Hey everyone, I've had some messages through already um, from people who took the Autumn Paper 1 today and they let me know that the predictions that I made were reasonably accurate. So that's always a relief. So I've got the same for Paper 2. So remember these are predictions that I made for the summer exams that were cancelled but I strongly believe that these predictions are still going to hold. Okay. So like I always say, please don't purely rely on these, but hopefully they'll give you some kind of advice and guidance as to what you could concentrate your revision on. So the first thing we'll do is just have a quick look at what's already been tested. So 2017 saw those topics tested. So you can see I've got a column there for year 12 stuff and then the year 13 stuff. 2018 saw those topics. And last year saw these topics being tested and you'll see I've added a little bit of extra detail there. So amount of substance was tested via titration, which is quite unusual for an organic paper. Alkenes had the electrophilic addition mechanism in and isomerism. The benzene question saw the bonding in benzene, that was the delocalised model versus Kekulé's structure, acylation, the electrophilic substitution mechanism, and quite a few reactions of benzene. The carbonyls question concentrated on aldehydes and the structure determination stuff at the bottom there that tested TLC, thin layer chromatography and the big structure determination question was an aromatic compound. So based on what's already been tested I've come up with this list for 2020. So I'm thinking a question on sigma bonding and pi bonding. Question on alkanes. We haven't seen the free radical substitution mechanism tested yet. And maybe something about ozone depletion. So the effect of those chlorine radicals and possibly bringing in the NO radicals as well as other things that will break down ozone. So sort of with an environmental slant on it. Benzene's going to be on, I'm sure, but this time the halogenation reactions, including the mechanism for that, and maybe something about comparing the reactivities of benzene with alkenes. Some phenol reactions, so one of those big synthetic root flow charts with the reactions on. Possibly synthesis of an organic liquid, so the separating funnel, drying agent, etc., question on amines, so possibly to suggest a mechanism between the haloalkanes and ammonia. Last year there was some stuff on unfamiliar mechanisms, so I'm thinking they could be going along those lines again. So suggest the mechanism between haloalkanes and ammonia. How do you ensure the production of a primary aliphatic amine? Some synthesis but involving carbon-carbon bond formation. Chirality, now that was on last year a little bit, but maybe drawing some more 3D diagrams of isomers, maybe thrown into the two chiral center uh, molecules to sort of spice it up a little bit. Gas chromatography, and maybe the calibration curves to determine the concentration of the component in the mixture. And there's always going to be a structure determination question I don't think it's going to be an aromatic one, possibly something with a nitrogen group in, so maybe an amine, so that could possibly tie in with this sort of question, or maybe amide. So that's it, that's the list. Hopefully some of those are right, but please, like I always say, these are guesses, and you don't just rely on this list. So I hope that was helpful and uh, best of luck for paper two and of course I'll be doing the same for paper three once paper two is out of the way.